Edexcel A-Level Maths, Pure Paper 2, October 2021, Question 9. We need to show that the sum from n equals 2 to infinity of 3 quarters to the power of n times by cos of 180 n is equal to 9 over 28. So the first thing to notice here is what happens with that cos as n changes. So thinking about the graph of cos and the shape of it, we can quickly see that cos 180 n is going to equal 1 when n is even. So for example, cos 0, cos 360, cos 720, and so on. And it's going to be negative 1 when n is odd. So cos of 180, cos of 540, and so on. So this gives us our sequence here. We'll start off with 3 quarters squared when n is 2. The cos becomes 1, so it's positive. When n is 3, the cos is negative, so we get minus 3 quarters cubed, and then plus 3 quarters to the power of 4, minus 3 quarters to the power of 5, and so on. So the power is going up by 1 each time, and we're flicking from positive to negative and back again. So we've now got a geometric sequence, and we can see quite quickly now that the first term is obviously 3 quarters squared, so 9 over 16. As our power is going up by 1 each time, and we're going from positive to negative and vice versa, our common ratio is negative three quarters. The three quarters brings the power up by one, the negative switches the sign. So now as we're doing the sum to infinity of a geometric sequence, we know A, we know R, we can put this into our formula, which is A over one minus R. So nine sixteenths over one plus three quarters, the minus a negative, which equals nine over 28 as required. If you've enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe to the Doing Maths channel to keep up to date with all the latest releases.